Hello everyone! Today we're going to do the taste test of Russian McDonald's two years later, which has the worst name in the history of any restaurant, which translates into Russian as tasty period or tasty that's it. It sounds terrible in English or in Russian and still nobody likes this name and every time I have to pronounce it out loud I cringe a little bit. But anyways let's see how a Russian McDonald's is doing two years later so let's go and eat some burgers. For today's video I chose a separately standing building of Kusnay Tochka instead of going somewhere to the shopping mall or to the food court I feel like it's a better option. It is Saturday and as you can see there is a lot of people inside, which I don't like, but we're gonna go through it, right? And that's how it looks like inside. It's just a one-story building sometimes they can be bigger than that. Here is a little Mac cafe section. This one is tiny actually. They sometimes can be a lot bigger. And standard thing for every McDonald's, you can either order here at the cashier or yourself at the computer. Заказывайте все, что хотите, не стесняйтесь. Безлимитный баланс. I don't know how this thing is called, even in Russian, so we are gonna order through this thing. I will call it computer for now. And as you can see, the interface inside, it looks pretty much like the McDonald's itself, except now the names are different. I honestly don't know what I'm going to get, probably not any of the combos, just regular burger with beef. And Двойной Yeah. I think it's too much for me. No, thank you, Milana. I think I'm gonna get Grand Deluxe. I'm also going to get French fries. Always get the smallest. Where is the smallest? This one. And my favorite cheese sauce. And I will get just like the girls uh, the milkshake. Какой вкус мне взять? Я брала шоколадный. Не, возьму вот этот. Фраппе? Не, фраппе не буду. Вот такой я взял. Я возьму, наверное, ванильный. Ванильный... Маленький. Маленький. And as you can see, there is no original cola anymore. Right now it's Dobre Cola, which is not the same, but very similar. And instead of Happy Meal, there is now Kids Combo. And I'm sure you all know who this girl is. And I think we are ready. Girls also made their order. Now let's pay. <laughs> I borrowed my friend's kids for today's video. Kids love McDonald's and also they always tell the truth. And it's always more fun to go to McDonald's with kids. I haven't myself been to Vkusnaya Tochka in a very, very long time. So let's do the taste test together. I forgot how it tastes, honestly. But if it's similar to the original McDonald's, I will definitely recognize it. And if we're comparing McDonald's in Russia and the US, in Russia, it's always been a little bit higher in class than in the US. In the US, I remember the contingent that was visiting McDonald's wasn't the best, whereas in Russia, I feel like it's more of the middle class who's visiting the McDonald's. And in the US, it's a little bit lower level. And actually, if comparing all McDonald's I've tried in my entire life, even uh, if we think of all McDonald's that used to be in Russia, in my opinion, the McDonald's in the US taste the worst out of all I've tried. And I would say the original McDonald's in Russia tasted like McDonald's in France. If you've been to French McDonald's, you know that they taste pretty good. Uh, it also tasted pretty good in Russia. 
So well, let's see how this one tastes. I don't feel very focused right now because there's a lot of people and it's very loud and also there's a lot of kids and they all stare at me because I'm with the camera. So I might sound a little bit not myself in this video. So that's what's inside the Happy Meal, or sorry, the kids box. French fries, a pie, and a chicken burger. And I think it's just a gift. So that's how the packaging looks like. I personally don't like it at all. It's quite boring. The original McDonald's packaging was way better. And they finally changed the logo on sauces. There used to be an M. And now it's the original Fusna Točka M. And the french fries looks regular. I got the cheese sauce, my favorite sauce in McDonald's. And let's see what Grand Deluxe looks like. <laughs> it looks like a regular McDonald's or basically any other burger. The packs for drinks also look really boring. This is from the cola and this one is from the milkshake. I don't like it at all. Time to try everything out. The milkshake is regular, but this one doesn't taste like in the old McDonald's at all. Good one. Good one. By the way, this was the gift in the gift box. Девочки, вам нравится вот это? Да. Вы это хотели? Да. Well, turns out they wanted that, so it's okay, I guess. By the time I filmed everything, <laughs> my French fries is completely cold. But it's still good though. It's good and it tastes like a regular French fries. By the way, all these girls are sisters and cousins. These two are sisters and it's their cousin. So I basically borrowed them from the same parents. The burger tastes excellent. Tastes excellent. Like not even the McDonald's level excellent, but very very good quality burger and it tastes exactly like the previous McDonald's burgers. I remember they taste quite well still, plus I just had one in Paris recently. So the burgers are definitely stayed the same. Do you want to eat it? Yes! Remember McFlurry? This is the Russian alternative called Ice Deluxe. And if the rest of the food is very similar to the original McDonald's, this one is one of those that is totally different and actually not that good. Because as you can see in the original McFlurry, they have real chocolate. Here, instead of real chocolate, this is like a chocolate cookie, which is very hard and not very delicious. So the original McFlurry is much better, but the actual white thing, the white ice cream tastes pretty much exactly the same as the previous McDonald's. А тебе как Ice Deluxe, Милана? Мне клубничку положили. А вообще в целом? Вкусно? Yeah, kids love everything. So, overall, what can I say? The french fries and the burger is the same as at the previous McDonald's, almost identical. The milkshake is a little bit different, also the ice cream completely different. Only the milky part is the same, but the feelings is different. Of course I haven't tried everything on the menu, but the few things that I've tried they have been very similar, except, as I said, the milky products, the dairy products and other desserts. The pie is the same also. And the burgers taste so similar, they even have that 
specific McDonald's scent, if you know what I'm talking about. Every time you enter a McDonald's in any country, you have this specific smell. You have this smell here when you walk into Russian McDonald's and the burgers also have the specific flavor. So, overall I can say it's pretty similar. Avoid the dairy products and the desserts if you don't want to be disappointed. But everything else I think it's pretty similar. The name is terrible, the packaging is as well, but the food itself, I don't think anybody is missing out. Ты помнишь на вкус какие были бургеры в Макдональдсе раньше? Не помнишь? Ну ладно, а как тебе эти бургеры нравятся? Вкусные? Очень. Девчонки, сестренки, вы помните какие были в Макдональдсе бургеры на вкус? Да, я помню. Ты помнишь, а ты Дарин? Да. Ну и что скажете, есть разница? Да. Ну я бы сказала то, что в Макдональдсе было мясо более насыщеннее. Ага. Кстати, точно. Согласна полностью. И мороженое. Ну, мороженое, да. А тебе, Дарин, как? Я думаю, во вкусной точке лучше. Ты думаешь, во вкусной точке лучше? Ты же моя патриотка. Что? Что за такая патриотка? Ну, вообще, в целом, вам вкусно? Нравится в Макдональдс ходить? Что, будете еще сниматься у меня? Ага. Да? Договорились. Девчонки, я нас поздравляю. Мы закончили. Вы мои лучшие актрисы. Спасибо вам большое.